Let me introduce now on this broadcast on India Today, Mr. Vyas Rajan, former ISRO scientist. He's essentially a pioneer of uh, the space journey in India. He was also awarded the Padma Shri for all of uh, his contributions to space tech, to space reform in India. Mr. Rajan, good evening. Pleasure to speak with you again here on India Today. Uh, can you explain to us, sir, why ISRO has put the focus on this kind of a sun mission? What do we stand to gain from an Aditya L1? Okay. Thank you. Thank you for giving me this opportunity. And then in the earlier program also, I was hearing a little bit. I mean, it has explained very well about how much distance, etc. So I won't repeat it. Sure. Most important thing about sun is not just merely you are studying a star. Please note that if there is no sun, we are not there in the earth. Hmm. It gives, it is a source of energy, it is a living. We live because of it. So that is why in all our ancient traditions, always sun is worshipped. Surya Namaskar, no, very ordinary people will go and will do that. Yes. And bulk of the solar system's mass is with the sun. Now, it's not only, of course, there is a lot of science about the, how the star will come, etc., etc. But mm. most importantly, if you look at some of those payloads, it is studying, they will say, they will just say photosphere, this one, that one, etc., including uh, not only the inner part, but also the outer part. What we see approximately, maybe we should never see a sun directly with the eye. It is very dangerous. Uh, but, but if you look at it with some glass or something, you will find, even otherwise it comes through a cloud or something, you will find a nice bright circle. Yeah. Don't think that is all what sun is. There is so much of it, much, much more in the mm. outer layer, which is called corona we get an opportunity to see it during eclipse. If some of you have seen it, they will say, during the eclipse, it gives a circuit. Then out Correct. of it, sometimes something and all will be coming. That part of it is the uh, corona, hmm. and some of it are not visible. And the coronal thing is something which is affecting our Earth's atmosphere, yet so many things. Yeah. Uh, and you don't know. And then very interestingly, see some numbers, which I say, even for me, it gets uh, mind-boggling when I uh, see the numbers again and again. Even I'm familiar with it. Mm. Lower atmosphere, that is about 5,730 centigrade. Our hottest piping water is 100 C, 100 okay. centigrade. That is the one which is, is that all? That is why we get a little yellowish and then the sodium spectrum and all we get. But hmm. now, to come to the upper atmosphere of the solar thing, it is 3, 3, 3, uh, 7. One crore, one crore degree hmm. centigrade. See that. In such a circumstance, uh, uh, Dr. Rajan, and uh, this may seem like a very pedestrian question, but I remember someone came and asked me this today. How is Aditya L1 going to be so close to the sun and yet shield itself from that kind of heat, from that kind of, uh, you know, uh, temperature? Because this is essentially a ball of fire. No, no, good, good question. It is nowhere near the sun. Hmm. It is much nearer than us, but nowhere near the sun. You know what is the sun's? Our distance to sun something 150 million kilometer. That is 15 mm. crore. Whereas this fellow will be only not even one percent of it. About 1.5 million, as it was told before, 1.15 lakh distance. It is still much, 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 much far away. The only human spacecraft, human-made thing, which has mm. gone very, very close to sun, is Eugen Parker. Parker solar probe. I think okay. it was done with a lot of pair of people would have forgotten it. 2018, August 12, 19, 2018 was launched. Hmm. Eugen Parker for me, because I started off my career with cosmic ray research, interplanetary dynamic processes. He wrote everything what it will be from theory. Hmm. He could see it. One fact, oh God, that old man, sir. Because most people who pro propose theory for such a complicated thing will never see it in their life. It may be 
he was 94 he saw it and he was mm. so happy he was very happy he is no more now so that is only one which has gone even that will be the closest approach will be still it is to take place will be 3.9 million okay. 39 million Close so in this that. particular in case, side, Dr. Rajan, side, it will be the other yeah. side, it will really enter into the sun. That no, is so Dubai. Aditya L1 is actually closer to the earth than it is to the sun, but it's still going yeah, to yeah, travel yeah, yeah. 1.5 million kilometers as you pointed out, Dr. Rajan. Final question yeah. to you, what do you think is the most challenging part of this mission? In Chandrayaan 3, it was a soft landing. What in this case is the most challenging part, sir? See, it has to go all the way up to that Lagrangian point. That means see sun uh, solar thing it was only 4 lakh 400 thousand mm. this is 15 lakhs okay that means this all these propulsion systems and all have to be going and then one thing we always say even though we know quite a bit more about uh, space one thing which is told about space even nasa will say it is that we don't know yet much thing what surprises it means yeah. we don't know meteors will come something will come so many other things. It is a cold, 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 cold place. Even though the sun may be there, when it sees mm. the sun, it is okay. But most of the time, it won't be seeing it. So that part of it will be important. And okay. then precisely getting into that Lagrangian point. Okay, so getting the there is point, the hardest is the one part. Where, where, where yeah. uh, as it was told very nicely, between the Earth and the sun's gravitational Correct. pull will become mm. equal. And then this fellow will be managing to go. It, it still will be going in an orbit. Nothing in the yes. world can stand. Nothing in the world can stand still. Are, Baba, one, one second, let me take rest. Everything has to be going. Earth has to be going. Moon has to be going. This fellow also will be going round and round. Then so we'll keep going in a halo orbit around the L1 point. Yeah, Dr. Yeah, Rajan, yeah. you've explained this in great, great detail to us. So thank you very much for joining us here on India Today. I think you've given us such clarity on really what the Aditya L1 mission is all about. India's number one political reporter. Defines what seems to be happening, vendetta politics. Unmatched eye. Unmatched experience. The world has changed. My black hair has become grey as well. And with unmatched passion for the story. Do not monopolize the conversation. When it's 100% news that matters. It's News Today with Rajdeep Sardesai. Monday to Friday, 9pm. Only on India Today TV. India's number one political reporter defines what seems to be happening vendetta politics Koi ke se dula hua nahi hai. unmatched eye unmatched experience the world has changed my black hair has become gray as well and with unmatched passion for the story do not monopolize the conversation when it's hundred percent news that matters it's news today with Rajdeep Sardesai Monday to Friday 9 p.m. only on India Today TV